I just want to put out a um, quick disclaimer that I know my English is not the best and my grammar is uh, most definitely not perfect but this video is just for entertainment and for having fun so don't hang on it thank you and enjoy the video what's up everyone and welcome back to my channel so around a week ago I posted to my Instagram stories that I'm gonna make a full-on YouTube video in English and this is it so I think you need to know that I am really really nervous right now and this is probably the hardest video I ever made as you might know I was learning English for such a long time before school in school and in high school also but I forgot a lot of things and you might know that my uh, English grammar is not the best and I haven't actually learned grammar as much as words and stuff like that i'm really just trying my best i guess if you don't follow me on instagram or else uh, my instagram is at abishwarbi i post a lot of stuff there um that is the number one platform i use all the time i think we should really just jump right in and say no more okay the first thing i'm gonna use is this l'oreal infloba foundation um the color is 125 natural rose uh, definitely not my color but we're gonna stick to that i put uh three or four pumps of foundation every time i use it i guess <laughs> which is a lot but i hate my natural face you know like without makeup and also can we just appreciate the fact that the day after tomorrow i'm gonna be on estrogen for two weeks now but i literally don't feel anything um except that I'm more hungry and uh, a little bit more angry. I'm naturally a stubborn person, which is not so good, but I'm trying to work on it. Also, I feel like I have to say that I never really seen um, someone do a makeup video in English who is actually Hungarian. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna use is this Revolution Super Size Conceal and Define Concealer in the shade C3, which is a really light shade, but I like when my under eyes are just like popping or completely white or bright as hell. I don't feel like my English is good, but I feel like I can make myself uh, understandable. Is that a word? I guess so. The next step in my routine is powder. The first thing I'm gonna start with is my under eyes because I get a lot of creases there, even though I use so much powder. and I just press it in. Sometimes I use a damp sponge, but sometimes I don't. <laughs> oh my God, my under eyes are literally like glowing. And I do my scar here because you know, I had a lip lift. So I always press powder in my scar. So it won't crease so much. And then my nose. After that, I switch to a brush, put it in the powder, top off the excess. And just tap it in. Oh my God, why am I so ugly? Okay, the next step is contouring and I use this big brush for my face and this Mix Matte Bronzer in the shade MBB02, deep. Wow, I'm not even that deep, so I guess I just like color. I'm sorry for any uh, background noises, but my cat loves to play um, and she's a little loud. <laughs> You know what, I actually imagined this video a lot worse. Well, we're gonna see in the end. <laughs> Why do I have such a big forehead? Oh my God, my hair is like totally not on my side today. Okay, I'm... Okay. I'm not used to this technique, but I saw it on, I guess, Sneaky Tutorials page. This is just a way on how to um, 
contour your nose easily so what you do is just use the contour a big brush and you just tap it on first all your nose is going to be brown a little more <laughs> don't be shy put some more you get back to your sponge and your powder and you're gonna bake the contour in so I don't know how it's gonna make sense but I'm gonna show you just put on your bake normally like you always the two lines are not the best right now they're not even straight just like me but we don't even care about that the next thing uh, is blush and I'm gonna use this brush you know just a little mm -hmm. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna do is my brows. Okay, so the product I'm gonna use is this MAC um, Pro Longwear Fluid Line, which is an eyebrow pomade. And the shade name is Deep Down, which is a <clears throat> dark brown shade. The first thing I always do is just comb my eyebrows upwards. And as you can see, I don't have the ends of my eyebrows because they are going so down. If you don't have the, the tail of the eyebrow, you can just flick it upwards more. Okay, so my trick is to always start with the bottom part of the eyebrow, I guess. And in the middle, always. <laughs> and then, um, just... Making it a little more up and down. I used to do it like always just up, but then the top would be so just not it for me. Okay, and then come the upper part down and then draw the upper part of it. And this is how I get my um, eyebrow shape, and then just fill the gaps in. And then just come it together because you can make um, the color blend more while you're just using this technique okay I'm, i think that's cute okay i think um that's done after my brows i always like to do uh, a little highlight and my all-time favorite is the fenty beauty one it's so dirty right now but this highlighter looks like it's almost diamonds melted in your skin it's like so beautiful and so perfect and it's um and it's like a wet look which is my favorite look in highlights and maybe the only highlight and i always like to use my fingers on my cheek and brushes on the rest of my face i'm gonna tell you this is the highlighter you ever wanted Okay, a little bit on the nose and on the bridge I always like to just go right in the middle and then just moving it with my fingers so it looks more natural I'm gonna wipe off the bake okay so as you can see my nose is looking um, a little smaller than usual Next thing I'm gonna grab is uh, my all-time fave um, matte liquid lipstick, which is from Lovely, and it's called K Lips. My favorite, uh, my favorite shade is the Lovely Lips, which is a uh, warmer pink. And I always like to just put a little bit more on the bottom lip and just. Smear it all around. So 
so I don't have to work more on the lines. And then I'm gonna use a mascara, which is the um, Essence Lash Princess, and the the brush is changed because I didn't like the things, the pink ones uh, brush, so I changed it. Okay. And the next thing I'm gonna grab is the lashes, and I don't know which one should I use today, but I'm gonna stick to these ones because I have more of them and they are a little bit longer, but when applied, they um, appear more natural. Oh my God, we are so natural today. I think when using a lash extension, the most important part is to trim them and this is going to be the front of it, so I'm gonna just cut off. So I always like to cut the end, so the end looks more long, you know, but I just trimmed off the, the inside part of it, so I don't know how it's gonna look, but you know, it's just me. While the glue is drying, I'm gonna just spray my face with some water. Oh my God, it's so refreshing. Oh, my mascara is just gone. Thank you, water. I have a trick for you. If you uh, mess up your mascara, don't wipe it away, don't smear it around. Just wait until it dries and just take a spoolie and just wipe it away and it's gonna just disappear. But be careful, it, it has to be completely dry because it's a, if it's a little bit wet, it's gonna leave marks. Okay, I'm gonna just up on the lashes and be right back oh my god I'm literally so scared <laughs> but anyways the last thing I'm gonna use is some lip gloss and this is by Fenty Beauty and the shade name is Fussy with um, dollar signs so I just don't like to use um, much of it because um, I don't like if uh, lip gloss is just sticky so I just used a really small amount of it and it's just perfect I guess and now I'm gonna this was here the whole entire video nice okay so uh, I'm gonna just quickly do my hair and get back to you okay and this is the completed look um, it's just like, you know, my everyday makeup. Very natural, very girly, very just like, no makeup makeup, you know. This video was probably the worst and hardest video I ever made, but I think I already said that once. Yeah, this was such a journey. But oh my gosh, can we just appreciate my lashes? They are so beautiful right now. Oh, okay. Um, I and thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, just give it a big thumbs up. And if you didn't like it, just you know, give me a dislike. I'm gonna be fun with that also. And we're gonna see each other. We're gonna see each other in the next video, uh, probably in Hungarian. Thank you for watching again, and bye.